the Toronto Raptors get themselves Jalen McDaniels. And this was funny because he was a sought after guy during the trade deadline that Philadelphia went and got, and he didn't do much for Philadelphia. He's Jaden McDaniel's brother. And Jalen gets himself a nifty little deal to go to Toronto, and he continues to be somebody who fits into the Toronto's Vision 6-9. And he's a guy that gets a two-year, $9.3 million deal. He's a, you know, a guy, a guy, I love using this phrase, a jack of all trades, a master of none. He can shoot, he can score, he can defend one through four. He can put the ball on the floor a little bit, but he's not a specialist in any skill. He's really a guy that you like to, you know, glue guy, okay? He's a guy who's going to do, do all the dirty work. Sometimes he'll show up in the stat sheet as like, you know, doing a lot. Sometimes he won't, but it'll depend depending on what you're doing on that night. But I'm, I'm definitely keen to see his impact in Toronto. He's a good player. They get him on a two-year deal, still young. I'm, I could see him being a guy who could surprise people and develop into a better player than we think he is now. But again, it's a, an easy little deal. Two years, $9.3 million. If it goes wrong, it's nothing to worry about. But it's a, a guy that for a team that is running back their core, who still wants to be a playoff team, he fits next to... Pascal Siakam, next to Scotty Barnes, OG Ananobi, you know, new three-point shooter, Grady Dick, Gary Trent Jr. It's just something that fits the, the culture that they're building out there. So I think it's rather a good move on, on the whole. It's a small move, not a huge needle mover, but something that's definitely fun to see and watch. But I, I want to hear your guys' thoughts. What do you guys think of this move? Was this something that you guys were expecting? Or are you surprised that Jalen McDaniels is now a Toronto Raptors? Let me hear your thoughts down below in the comment section. But that's about it for me today, guys. Peace out.